Welcome back to Apache series of lectures. Let's deploy a basic WSGI application. There are some prerequisites. You need to install mod underscore WSGI to make WSGI application work. I have downloaded a sample script from the internet. Let's first install the mod underscore WSCI. Without this, this application will not work. App.WSCI. I've downloaded it randomly from internet. Let's first set up the configurations. <coughs> Previously we, we set up CGI application. This time we are setting up WSGI application. You can see the difference of configuration between these two scripts. This time we will we use WSGI script alias instead of script alias. And WSGI script alias we would need to define the full path of the application or the script. This is app.wsgi is the name of the file that we will create a little while later. Check for syntax errors. Yeah, it misspelled. Or no, include it. It's a typing mistake, WSGI, script alias, my app points towards this box. Syntax is ok now. Let's copy paste the script onto the file. confirm the directory path name of the file that we just gave in the configuration file paste the value here this step should be executable to make it run If you don't make it executable, it will not display anything. confirming the settings that there is nothing wrong with the configurations let's check for security context looks ok for CGI in my app we need to change it we need to set it first that should be httpd underscore sys underscore script underscore exec underscore t
<coughs> and the restore home. Now I see Linux context looks okay. Also executable. Let's try the links. <coughs> Want to display it? Downloaded it from this website. I downloaded this WSGI script from this website. I just forgot to restart the service, that's why it was not displaying anything. Hello world. The script is working fine now. Let's try with e links as well. It's okay now. With both the browsers, it's displaying. Okay. This is the website from where I have downloaded this script. <coughs> Just to show you how WSGI applications work. Thank you for watching this lecture.